You, my lord, best know who least will seem to do so. My past life hath been as continent, as chaste, as true as I am now unhappy, which is more than history can pattern, though devised and played to take spectators. For behold me, a fellow of the royal bed, which owe a moiety of the throne, a great king's daughter, the mother to a hopeful prince, here standing to prate and talk for life and honor for those who please to come and hear. For life I prize it as I weigh grief, which I would spare. For honor tis a derivative from me to mine, and only that I stand for. I appeal to your own conscience, sir. Before Polixenes came to your court, how I was in your graces, how merited to be so. Since he came, with what encounter so and current have I strained to appear thus? If one jot beyond the bound of honor, or an act or will that way inclining, harden be the hearts of all that hear me, and my nearest of kin cry fie upon my grave. When I said she liked Elizabeth because Elizabeth is a lesbian, what did I mean? Really, I, I think I meant Elizabeth is great. She liked her because she's great. Why, why do I say lesbian instead of great? I don't know. Maybe I don't really want to be a lesbian. Maybe I just want to be great. Do I have to be a lesbian to be great? I'll ask Elizabeth. She wasn't always a lesbian. She wasn't always great either. <laughs> Who came first, lesbianism or the greatness? When did she become lesbian? Les lesbianistic? Is that a word? Use it in a sentence. Never mind. Set the point, just ask. Of course, she hardly ever listens to me, unless I cry. When I cry, she listens. Okay, yeah, I'll cry. It's demeaning, but I'll do it. Because I, ne I need to know. I mean, I <laughs> I'm working things out here, important things. Yeah. I have to find a place, I've got to find a place where everything can be the same.